Yo, what is going on YouTube? Welcome back and welcome to Chris Wrestling Views here on YouTube.com. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel you guys are doing today. So you guys, I have been posing as I normally would, but later this week, I probably will be. You'll see. So you guys, um, Wardlow. So we're going to talk about Wardlow today. We're also going to talk about MJF and about Triple H and all that good stuff. But getting to Wardlow. Wardlow is one, basically one of the strongest people, um in AEW, you know, um, as well. So with Wardlow, um, it's being said that what's going around now, I'm not sure if it's true, but it is saying, like I said, it's being said that Wardlow has been removed from the AEW roster. Is it, it has he been removed because it's a work between MJF and Wardlow or have he actually like basically left AEW and just walked out on the company I mean what what do you guys think I want to know like some bait you know some basic um you know you know scenarios just to figure out you know where has um Wardlow going so of course um more news you guys MJF um says he will not resign his contract you guys with AEW and his contract expires with AEW um, in 2024, which is basically like two years away. But you never know because most superstars walk out of companies and everything like that. But you're still in contract with the company. So you guys, could MJF and Wardlow be headed over to WWE as years to come and, you know, basically do their thing there? But then again, you guys, I'm ready to see what is next for uh, Wardlow. I'm ready to see has he really left AEW? Is it a work? What it what it basically is? I don't know. But a lot of people say it's a work. But he's being removed from the AEW roster and all that. Who knows? So you guys, next I'm going to talk about Triple H, the Cerebral Assassin, the King of Kings, um, the 14, 14. No, he's a 16. I can't remember if he's a 14 or 16 time war heavyweight champion. Um, yes, you guys, we know a couple months ago, Triple H had open heart surgery. And with him having open heart surgery, you guys, Triple H was on ESPN today. And I'm going to drop that link down below in the description so you can check it out as well. That Triple H said he has announced his retirement from in ring competition. Now, we know that Triple H was um, put into the WWE Hall of Fame back in 2019 and you guys triple h has done some of the most incredible work in the ring he has fought against roman reigns he's fought against brock lesnar he's fought against the undertaker on uh, undertaker like twice already i mean he doesn't fight some of the greatest superstars ever you guys the ones have passed and gone the ones that are still uh here today the ones that are you know just basically all around he had the company NXT, of course, you guys, with him having NXT, it was a very fantastic show to actually see, you know, even though we couldn't see Raw or see SmackDown on that day, but we could see a black and gold brand of NXT. Now that's being taken over you guys by Vince. Let me know what you guys think on this. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching Chris Wrestling Reviews here on YouTube.com. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay tuned. Peace.